Alright guys, welcome to another episode of Healthy Junk Cruise, where we review junk food in the nude! <laughs> no, that's no. just some new thing we're trying to do. <laughs> <laughs> we just, uh... <laughs> We're actually at Jack in the Box. I'm with Ken Domic from KVD Peace. Productions TV, and in the back we got. What's up, dudes? Chip from the Bronx again. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. All right, let's do this. Let's do it. Hi, Ro. Hi, can you give me one second? Hold on. Uh, one second, too long. She's gonna spit my food now. Yeah, I know, right? <laughs> That's the challenge. Like, Chuck's challenges. You gotta eat it. You gotta piss them off. Never <laughs> anger the people that make you food. I got make. all these antibodies from everyone's saliva. This Del Taco drink is awesome. <laughs> Did we get a um, sourdough jack? We'll also get a spicy sriracha. Yeah, I'll go with a taco. <laughs> <laughs> I'm going to try a bacon and Swiss buttery jack. On a taco? <laughs> and that will complete my order. Hello, I'm Bad Man. I am back. <laughs> Tell me, Neo, how are you gonna make a phone call if you don't have a mouth? <laughs> there is no spoon. <laughs> I almost feel like Deadpool right now. Why is the word lift so hard to say? Why is the word abbreviation so long? Why are apartments stuck together? Why do we drive in parkways and park in driveways? Is Disneyland just a people trap run by a mouse? Ketchup rice. Uh huh. Ketchup rice. Ketchup and rice. Ranch. Okay, Hi, Julia, this is what you ordered. Ranch That's it? That was the large. Mm, I'm gonna gargle later. We gotta get Chuck his, uh, his taco. Oh taco. <laughs> <It'd be> phenomenal. <laughs> <laughs> Ooh, There's your... I got a bot. Yeah. Nice. The man wants beef. What does that say? Oh, the name's beef. Oh. This is Julia's sandwich. That looks half decent. I'm gonna take her first bite. <laughs> yeah, go ahead. That's, That's a sriracha, isn't it? Mm-hmm. Yeah. I loved it. Mm. You I tried got, it? Yeah, I, had, I did a review of it. The I got first some time of the, I, first time I came out to the West Coast. Nice. I think I ate some of the paper. I, you did. I'll show you mine. Ooh. If you show me yours. Ooh la la. So it is a round burger. Oh, I love how you it, hold these things. Yeah, I don't know how I do it. Ooh. And it's got, looks like bacon. Bacon bacon. Bacon bacon, that's like the microwavable bacon. We're not bacon. mistaken. Oh, that's not good. And then, um, here's mine, let's do that slow. Yo B, let's do that slow rotisserie. <laughs> slow rotisserie turn. Real week in the streets. I like when you do this though, like, alright guys, so I got the buttery jack. Let's see if it looks like the picture. Sorry, Ken, it's gonna go up on your face. <laughs> Ding! <laughs> <laughs> that's always fun. This is buttery though. Oh my god, this should be called a croissant. What is a goo in the middle? Oh man, I think that must be like, it's definitely a goo. I think white. it's just liquid cheese, man. Yeah, that's what I'm Did thinking. Do you wanna pull this one apart too, JP? It oh man. Okay. The food just doesn't look as good when you're showing it on the camera. Right? <laughs> yeah. That looks <laughs> disgusting. And then we got this. Which I'm pretty sure you can get in the grocery store, those taco things. I've actually seen this before. I'm going to find a picture of it. I'm going to throw it up on the screen. But, dude, this looks just like those things that I used to buy in bulk at, at the grocery store. I think that's what Jack in the Box did, actually. Here goes the taco. Mmm. I already took one bite, but I'm going to take another bite for the health of it. This is actually pretty good. Man? Yeah. Yeah, I'm enjoying this. So you like the tacos from the burger joint, and you like the burger from the taco joint. Yeah. Oh my yeah. god, this is... This burger reminds me of Five Guys. Ooh la la. <laughs> <laughs> the restaurant. <laughs> that could have come awesome. out so wrong. It did come out wrong. <laughs> out of all the fast food places we've gone to, we've gone to In-N-Out, Carl's Jr., and I've had Burger King McDonald's Wendy's. This is probably the best tasting beef. I've really? had out of all of them. Oh my god, it's, it's, I think it's because it's so greasy. Yeah, that'll do it. Your potty, for some reason, is bigger than my potty. Ooh la la. I came out wrong. Too. I, came out wrong. <laughs> I was gonna say, I don't hear that very often. No, I'm just kidding. What totally makes this burger is the bun. The bacon's not helping it, but the patty is almost of a decent size, but mm. how did you like the sriracha? Did it have mm. some nice little kick to it? You were right. That was that would be my choice out of all this stuff. Mm. It's really good. It's really yeah. good. The jalapenos add so much to it, too. And this was your first time in a jacket? This is my box? first time in a jacket in a box. I'm telling you right now, all this food I've been eating is, is, is good, and I'm going to give this again. I'm probably going to give this another four and a half out of five. I'll go out and get it now or whatever. Um, based on adding jalapenos and sriracha to it, I'm going to give this 250 out of 300 thing. and negative 300. 300 out of 300. Negative 300. <laughs> I honestly would say go out and get this as well. Check out Ken Domic's review of this. I bet it gives a better rating than I could ever give because <laughs> he does this better than I do. You did a good job. <laughs> Thank you. That taco I had it was actually pretty good, actually. On a scale of 1 to 5, I would give it a 4. Uh, mine was, uh, I would say it's an indifferent. I would say 
what Julia ate was like the best thing on their menu uh, out of the things that I've tried. Uh, this I probably would never buy again. Although the bun was really good. Yeah. We should absolutely make <clears throat> that burger at home too on recreatability. I'd say it's, Easy? it's no, I think it's probably hard. If you guys want to see any of these being recreated or anything else from Jack in the Box, please hit that suggestion up in the comments below. And make sure you go and check out Ken Domic's food reviews and Shut from the Bronx What's up? because these guys are all a part of a big family of ours, big food community. If you like this video and you want to see more, make sure to hit subscribe and check out these other related videos. Um, if you're interested in giving us a request, make sure to send them the comments right below. And uh, remember, it's not healthy. If it's healthy. <laughs> hey, I'm Chuck from the Bronx. What's up? Yeah. How you doing? <laughs> What's up there? How you doing? This is what happens when KBD goes into the restaurant that he doesn't show. He's very attractive, so. I probably have the, the Dell cheeseburger. Yeah. And I'm gonna do the, uh, the steak and potato. Look at Ken, he's so giving. He's like, let me buy all you guys food. I love KBD production. I really do.